Well, I mean, it's not the easiest job. I mean, but it's just my life. I've been 30 years now as skipper of the Budding Rose, and I don't know anything else. It's just my life going out there, catching fish, and coming back in. So, I mean, there's plenty of other hard jobs out there. So, I mean, the fishing is hard, but it's not so hard as it used to be. We've caught the 400 boxes for a couple of days fishing. I mean, that's really good fishing. It's about 20 ton for the two days. So. I mean, the stock I've had it in the North Sea is looking really, really healthy. We sailed on, on Thursday and we went off 40 miles, sh shot our nets and towed for four hours and we hauled up with a few ton of paddock. So it's just a constant 24 hours a day. But I mean, we've been going out lately and I mean, the trips are a lot shorter than they used to be. So the fish is just top quality, you know? I mean, it's, it's so fresh. We've got MSC accreditation for our haddock. And uh, I mean, that shows that we fish it in a sustainable way and that we're not taking too much of the stock out of the sea. We're leaving, we're leaving a lot for the future. After the boats, we're happy with the, the amount of uh, fish we've caught. We come back into Peterhead the fish market here and we land the fish right, right away into this uh, refrigerated fish market. Fish is all iced up and uh, they're sold at the auction. And then they go off to go to local processors and they're all filleted, processed there, and they go all over Scotland, England, Europe. I mean, I would really encourage people to, to, to really ask where they're getting their fish from. If you go into the chip shop, ask, is this, is, this fish, is this fish caught by a UK boat by a British fisherman? You know, because it's really good if, if they support our fishing communities.